happy Sunday guys this is my CVS deal for March 5th to the 11th there are a couple of deals that I want to share with y'all they're really really good I'm gonna go by my first transaction my first transaction was on the cereal I know I overlooked this deal I think it's a really good deal it's on the buy 20 get 10 extra bucks back and the one I thought was really good is on the general meal cereal they're three for ten so you need to buy six boxes for it to be 20 and the one who qualify for this deal are the oops, cinnamon toast crunch cookie crisp cocoa puffs Reese's puff and the lucky charms and that includes the high nut cheerios there's two coupons that you could do for this deal um, this is a really good deal to start your um, couponing experience because all the coupons that I'm going to use did come out this week other than the huggies Alright, so here's the coupon that came out this week. They're a dollar off two. You could use three of these, we're making it six three dollars. And two weeks ago on the 212 Smart Source came these coupons. They're 75 off one box, which is awesome. You could use six of these ones. Um here I broke it down by coupons. If you I need to get six boxes, and if you do get the, if you already have the dollar coupon for this week, you can buy three, and it is a lot out of pocket, seventeen dollars, but you get ten extra bucks back, making it a dollar sixteen each box of cereal. But if you do have the two weeks ago coupon of seventy five cents, you use six coupons of those, making it four fifty of coupons. You do pay fifteen fifty, but each box is ninety one cents. I had dollar peelies that I got last year and they expired this year so I got six of those so for a dollar it's six dollar coupon and my CVS uh, machine when I scanned my CVS card it was a dollar off four of cereal I used that one so in total mine was seven dollars in coupons I did pay thirteen dollars making it about fifty cents per box give and take <laughs> about 50 cents a box so that was a pretty good deal on General Mills if you like to do that deal because there haven't been no cereal deals at all here's my receipt here are six boxes of cereal six dollar coupons for my peelies I had five extra bucks from last week and my beauty buck so I had ten dollars and extra bucks and my dollar one dollar of four and breakfast so in total I did pay three dollars and I did get my ten dollar extra buck for the cereal. I used it for my second transactions which were the diapers. Hey guys sorry I had to come outside there was a group of people that came in that was just so loud that I couldn't film inside. I'm still at the CVS parking lot so I still want to get this video out for you guys. So here we go here's the hoodies deals they're two for twenty and you get five extra bucks when you buy two. There's a four dollar off coupon at CVS.com and I think there's a two dollar coupon for each one at coupons.com if you want to do this deal. I, my printer does not work, so I couldn't get a printable version of this. I did have a $3 off 2 coupon that came out last week, I believe. And they come out with the, this one. It's on the package Huggies, and I think there's another $3 off uh, Little Snugglers only. So uh, using this coupon and the CVS coupon I had for last week of $3 off 20 I had six dollars in total in coupons. I paid fourteen, got five extra bucks back, making it four dollars and fifty cents to each package. That is not cheap for me. I had to buy some for some baby shower gifts I'm doing. So it really does hurt to buy it so expensive. But if you have these coupons, I think they come out to three fifty to three dollars a piece, which is really good. I tend to buy them at two fifty or at nine a dollar ninety nine. But I needed them. But if you want to do this deal, this is a really good deal to do. Here is my receipt. Here are my two, oops, sorry, my two snuggles, little snuggles, my two pampers, my $3 coupon, and my $10 coupon from the cereal of first transaction, and my 3 of 20 in diapers. So I paid $4.33 out of pocket, and I did get back, oops, where are you? My $5 ECB for the diapers. So these two first transactions are big items and they're a lot of money but if you're doing a transaction you tend to pay less here we have our third transaction this is a deal on Garnier Fruities or Garnier anything Garnier Fruities right yeah they're spend 12 get 4 extra bucks back 
You could either do the whole blends, because they're both two for seven, and they're both two dollar coupons. I did whole blends, but you could do garden fruit teas on this deal. So what I did, we need to get 12 bucks, so you need to buy four, making it 14 out of pocket. And there is two dollar coupons for the whole blends that came out this week in your red plum. This is two dollars of whole blends. And this one is two dollars of Garnier Fruit Teas shampoo. So you use either one. You can mix and match if you want. So that's eight dollars in coupons. So you pay six dollars, you get four extra bucks back, making it fifty cents a piece. Here is oops my receipt. There are the four whole blends, four coupons of two dollars, five dollars for the diaper transaction second. And I had a dollar of four hair care, making my total free or nothing, nothing out of pocket. They weren't free. They're like, I think 25 cents with the coupons I grabbed. Yeah, they're 25 cents a piece, so they weren't free. But still, it was pretty good. I did get my four extra bucks back. This four dollars, I was going to use it for my last transaction, but I miscalculated and my total was three dollars. But here's my four extra bucks for the whole blends. The last deal I did was my fourth transaction was on the Colgate the two ninety nine. There's a two dollar coupon that came out this week and it's on the Colgate Advent Colgate Total Advance. It's two dollars making it ninety nine cents. You did get ninety nine cents back making it completely free. But you get back a dollar back making it free. Um here it is two ninety nine two dollar coupon ninety nine cents you get one extra buck back so it makes it free or one cent money maker. Um, I don't have the coupon to show you because I only bought two, so I did this two per card so I could use my two off two Colgate coupon, which is pretty awesome. Making it two dollar money maker. That's what it was, two dollar money maker. And then I did this. I only I bought the fabric softener. They're two for six because I needed fabric softener. So the two for six is two dollar coupon that came out this week, two dollars. And I had a dollar off six um, of laundry care, making it. Three dollars for both, making a dollar fifty. So that's a pretty good deal. Here's my receipt. Here are the two snugglers and the two Colgate. I used two dollars, two dollar coupons for the Colgate and two dollar of the little snugglers. Two of two Colgate CVS coupon and one of six laundry um, coupon CVS. In total, I paid three twenty three, and I did get back my two dollars extra buck. So pretty much was a really good deal. Yay! That's all I have for you guys. I wish I would have done this inside with a bit way better lighting. But hopefully this video was educational. Please have questions. I would answer for you on the bottom of the questionnaire. Um, so have a good day. Bye. Pause. Bye.